Okay, girl. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Downs! Downs! Back up, girl. Downs! Where are you? Oh, Mr. Downs! Downs! Oh, Mr. Downs! You, uh, uh, whatever do you want? <laughs> Mr. Thomas Downs? Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, come here, maggot. Please, sir, I'm, I'll... Really? Certainly, would you? Uh, I have a family, sir. Please. I care about your family. Have to come to this. Huh? Ah! We took her. Now we'll take your hat. No. You ain't such a dude, are you? If you're running out on debts. I'm not running anywhere. I'm. I'm if you'd been good, this wouldn't be happening. You borrowed money from my bear Strauss. You owe him. Took the money. He wants it back. What's not to understand? <coughs> Where's I? I don't have it. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> what are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't his idea of charity. Get us the money. Damn. Damn. You missing your tree yet? I feel like I'm down. We'll all be watching you. Okay, I'll catch you later then. See ya, Arthur. Oh, I guess, okay, he's doing good. He's part of our team. So, uh, that's good. I guess. I can't. Why is it turning all dark all of a sudden? Oh, no.
Ah! Did you get on? Not so good. He was dead. And they seem more or less destitute fool for lending them the money. Then, people who aren't desperate seem so interest positions. Of course. That was it. Alright. Ah, medicine. Sweet. Alright, so it looks like, do we get any more money? Uh, contribute. Same money I can give. Get item. Alright, looks like so let's donate. That's it. Alright, now we have 55 or 59. So let's do Alright, good. Got some more of that. Some story. Mr. Morgan! Oh, sh no money. Alright. Um. Guess let's get some money. Can I give money? Give me money out and give an item. Um, uh, bucks. Let's give them that. Please, let's just donate that. And then. That's about it. I have nine bucks. Alright, let's, uh. Again, any clothes or anything? Do you need any clothes? Put a vest on. I think I can customize that. So, all right. So, can't do customize anything, but that's fine. Let's uh, let's get our health. A letter. Dear Arthur, I've written this a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's you know it's me from the bad handwriting. I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, the time. But I'm not so people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine a couple of months. It's some bad luck, and, well, it's a story, an interesting one, but I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, you and your associates in town, and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again, if you could spare me to your time, Chadwick Farm, the time Mary Linton. Huh. All right. Oh boy. Uh, let's, uh, let's... What are you doing? Look like I'm... Like you're reading. And I am. Let's well, sleep till morning. That looks like morning, but let's just sleep anyway. I'm sorry. Hi there.
Oh, you missed it. I was trying to, uh, was, uh, set up the stream, and all of a sudden a random dude came up to me. He was like, you better move. And he shot me. Right. I was like, oh. Dutch? You're so sh Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet. But Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of big jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. That Micah! Dutch! Arthur! Uh, what's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in It's okay, son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in straw. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that. I can't go. My face will be off Elizabeth. I can. He would do it for you. I don't think he... Uh, I, yeah, I don't think I so don't either. Ride. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid strawberry. Get him drunk. No crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll do it, Dutch. Just can't do everything. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's... Fallon. Alright. Let's take the right now. Alright. Oh. Hey, Bill. Did you find much in the old drift? I rode as fast as I could, not for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally All get right. off that mountain. Yes. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into one of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Fuck of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. Got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take you. So you're gonna go yeah. get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about it. It was that started all this. We'll just have a cup, settle you down, then head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? Oh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. <laughs> if you say so. I just... That's funny. Bye. Yeah. Really close. I didn't see that dude. All right. Whoa, here we are. <laughs> I don't pay you anything because I, you know, I'm kind of old.
Oh, wire's cr crowded. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Micah... A lot Mike... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut... You shut up. Be quiet, buddy. Oh, there, dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> and leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People have been leaving me alone for the last ten years. I'm bored with being left alone. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. <laughs> but me and the we're trying to talk business, so could you leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. Uh, no. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Pardon. Lady, where are Oh, no. You know which way my friend went? My friend in you all right there, Slugger? Think your friend went upstairs. Oh no. Cam, found my friend. You know where he went? No, no. Filler I was with. Last me. Oh no. What are you doing, kid? Hello. Your mouth, mister. Wait, what? I'm in first. I guess I'm stuck in first person. Oh, Lenny! Found you, Lenny! <laughs> How many of you have? Lenny! I'm Clyde. Wrong fella. Damn, I'm a Huh? Oh, shit. You are Lenny. Oh, 
Oh no, we're gonna end up in prison. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? What? <laughs> oh no. You moron. Not again. What the freak am I? I need to take some energy, right? There we go. Where am I? Wow, I'm really far. Uh, hey there, partner. to know yeah, do you smoke sir sure but not as much as you oh <laughs> no no don't worry about these actually well, take some take a couple of packs take a few oh thank you what are all the cigarettes for are you heading on a long journey or something <coughs> no, no 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 nothing like that i'm cards okay cards oh you got me yeah well get them out let me come on come on <laughs> yeah i'll pay you good okay here Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure, well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the money? <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure! A complete set is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunners. Over here, circus freaks. That says, meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rambottom, at your service. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Complete set. Where the value lies. All right. Not a Find 12 cards. Hey, boy. You a good dog? Huh. I guess I have to study, like, all the other animals. 
That's funny. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Think you made a big enough mess around here? Look, there must be some misunderstanding. Your own business, I promise you. Alright, so how the hell do we get. I'm on the train. Good. You can take me where I need to go. It's like I'm riding. Sweet. Hopefully, it'll take me where I need to go. But first, let's see. If... Oh yeah. Some more loot right here. Hello. How do I? I need to rest though, so... Oh, sh... Hey, you! You gotta leave now! Nope. Nope, this is my train. Get off the train. That's cool. Oh, hundred. Oh. oh my god. Oh. All right. Well, I'm dead.
<laughs> that was pretty funny. All right, how the, how the, oh, my horse. There's my horse. He's probably got a leap. Um, uh oh, I hate that. Damn, slip my hair back. Um, oh, that's cool. I can just do There we go. I got my horse. Let's get yeah. going. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. What is this? Why is it? I still have a bounty on me? Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought I, I lost a bounty. It's a hundred and... Bounty on me for hundred and ten dollars. I don't know. Oh. Alright, girl. Yep. Easy girl. Twinkle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Yeah, sure. Hop on. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. I have a ride. You know, ranch. Mind taking me there? Oh. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. <laughs> raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. That horse did right by me. Better than my husband. Told. That fool always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man, his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Yeah. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, brave, didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of the boys pull a gun on me once? I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm pad. Must have dozed oh off. But I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, it's wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise. Because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh. That one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <laughs> you live at Emerald Ranch then? Yep. For the I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch. Well, it's a strange place. So? Owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. The last bull folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. I see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Saloon there, 
all shut down now, but I went in to have a look, and there's bulls, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left, especially now I'm that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Oh, we're getting close now. Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way of thanking you. <sighs> Appreciate it. <sighs> what a lousy... Oh, there's something over here. Hold on. <laughs> That's an interesting way of putting it, Shane. No doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. Right, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes. I can ain't the Preston is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing this odd line. Of course. As honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can't him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. Barn. Now, you go get that. And it together. It's old Bob Crawford. It's a mine to take out your competition. Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage, I also want to see if he's got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmen de Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your bit, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But your father's robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> right, let's go see horse. Let's go see horse. Really? Really. Dad, the place is just here. Alright. Let's see. Uh... Boom. You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Well, clearly you've recovered from your encounter. Hi, sir. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strength. That's usually how it goes. Yes, you know how. Come on, Hosea. That feather's a joke. Out. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence and coaches? That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach sold by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. What's the story with that Emerald Ranch? Did you find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all the is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Use loon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. How oh, he used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house? Probably just sweet on her. That we all finding out a little? Once it's up, hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. 
Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Cannot kill anyone, so uh, I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Now, I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little sh**. You sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until night, and then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Uh, do it at night. Just wait. Easier okay. at night. Let's go. Sure. Hopefully, my stamina. Go into the house. Out. I'll go find this wagon. Right. Take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all quiet. I'm gonna go in this house and wait. Seems clear. Close this so it looks like we don't even, we weren't even here. Should I keep going? Sweet, I can pay off my gun. Alright, I'm making a risky move.
Alright, let's get out of here. I feel like they're gonna wake up and then, like, our horse are gonna wanna come after us. <laughs> My horse and seahorse is full. the better right now. Just need to get this back to Seamus in one piece and it's a good night's work. So what a lift. Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. It wasn't the first Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye, and as usual, he did not flinch. Exactly. How long do you think we're going to stick around here for? Not sure. Till we can't, I suppose. Like we're starting to get back to the feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long being full. I hope it's not stashed in town like we did want it. Even if we had to dump the money from the f we could have just got the rest out hidden someplace else. No, I think we've learned our lesson there. And a few other lessons besides. Look out! Easy, Arthur! See? Now the horse. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> oh my god. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. <clears throat> Parked it. Quickly. Oh shit, I'm wanted. Uh, makes sense because I just uh, read Nice so work, Jose. <laughs> the Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Let's, uh, you know. Wait. <laughs> we fa- <laughs> okay. We failed. I, <laughs> I can't believe that. work Hosea it was mostly Arthur like I said coarse but competent thank you if you find any other coaches that need I'll see what I can offer you for them but discreet you know of course goodbye gentlemen I'm heading back to camp I think you coming uh am I getting try this again Okay, good. <laughs>
All right. Oh, I'm definitely gonna sell the. I'm gonna get some re uh, rest in the game because I need to. Oh yeah, I already saw that. All right. Good morning, Arthur. You okay? Yeah, just fed up with all the pessimism around here. I hear you. All right. Let's see. Oh, that's for. Uh, got a huge bear in my head. So let's let's go to Valentine and get rid of my money and then sell all the crap that I stole. So at least I'll have more money. Morning, Arthur. Morning. Yeah. All right, let's go to the horse. Here we go. On my face? No, I don't have the bandana. All right. How there, Mister? Go away. Oh wow, yeah. people are just brute on here. They're like, oh. Disconnected from the party. I'm back now. All right. Looks like the train came. Should be good, but yeah, I'm gonna pay off that bounty. Stop. There we go. You know, I'm gonna roll up here. I can walk, well, actually walk into town. Ah, you're back. What can I do for you? You must have done some real trouble to acquire this kind of price in your head. Uh, yeah, I did a lot. <laughs> I just drunk and got into a train Thanks, fight, partner. apparently. There's the horse. Uh, here we go. Mission right here. Uh, I think. Oh, yeah, I need to go to so I can sell all this crap. I stole from that one guy's house. It's a. I just spent $100. Hey, you're okay, girl. Let's talk about this! Arthur! Arthur, come lend a hand here. What? Go ahead and call your mama for all I care. 
Take it easy, I'm got go. that early. You pathetic old man. You could have stepped in. I thought you had it. Just wait till you're old. I'll be at camp if you need me. All right. Come on, horse. Yep. I just did that. All right, whatever. Let's just. Uh... Oops. I knew you'd be back. Um, Let's sell all my stuff. Uh. What did I steal from these guys? Don't really need Anything? it, but. Anything that's worth money. A lot of money. I don't want that. Uh. Nothing good. Some of the fell ogre down at Flatneck Station said they had a clergyman in. Drunk out of his mind. No, I don't need that. Alright. Let me know how that works out. Let's go. I still do that one mission up here. All right, stay here, girl. You love, we love and. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton, a collar for you. Hello. Mary. I heard you and your friends was around. I. Okay. Where's um name? Dot. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad. Sure. So. uh... You've been, <clears throat> you've been made a widow, and you come here looking for me. Is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Ah, okay. Listen, Arthur, I, my family, I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down me? And you... It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. <laughs> He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my money. Life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians. That strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite Arthur. They'll kill him. You're only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I understand you don't want to help me, but I think of you all. Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I let Jamie's life and not the not that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please. Arthur, will you help me? Where is it? Somewhere out near Dell, I think. The rancher there around the Cumberland Forest. I just want him back, Arthur. 
If you find him, bring him to me at the station. See what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Girl? Alright, where is this place at? Right there. Huh? What's up? Yeah, I'm already at Valentine. Uh, helping out my ex, uh, ex lover with the mission. Morning, friend. Hey. I'm in chapter two. It's a side. It's a not a other mission. I'm hyped for it. Oh, I like it. It's pretty cool. Um, I kind of like the, the hair and the beard. Uh, how it's like it grows over time. That. Easy, girl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I do. And then, uh, called. I, uh, I found out how to change your clothes, so I, I did that. Yeah, I, I, I run a room. You got it. By the way, uh, do you know Achievement Hunter? Rooster Teeth? On YouTube? Alright. So, Achievement Hunters, they have them in here. And I found Jack already, and I found uh, Jeff from Achievement Hunter already. Uh, Jack yeah. is going to be in the Valentine, in Valentine, and he's going to be the owner of the, uh, the hotel. Uh. You better shut up your mouth, Hold or on. I'll shut it for yeah. Oh, shit. Uh, the horse... Please help me out of here. Yeah? Thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. Oh, I... I did. It's all right. <laughs> Over now. I did. And then also, um... I got... Nice folks here. Well, I got, uh... Because I... Because I got... I got the hundred dollar one game. I got it free. And horses. So. Ah. So, so I have kind of the, all the guns and all that stuff. And then, um, also. <coughs> what did you name your horse? You had to buy a new one. If you're at that part. Yeah, I did too. But what did you, you can name, name it. Ah, uh, okay. Um, uh, mine is Seahorse. And she's like, ah, what's yeah. funny? Like, Seahorse. <laughs> oh, yeah, I do. Honestly. That's a good girl. What, where are you at right now in the story? Oh, okay. You're okay, girl. I have a question. Where the horse... Yeah, I have to do that, but just stop for a second. Oh. I 
I have a question. When I have my horse, um, when I'm on my horse, that little heart goes up, and like red keeps flashing in that. What does that mean? Is that you see? What does that mean? Okay, but it's like flashing it. Flashing like a. Gonna throw you off. Yeah, they're getting tired. Ah, and that means death because they're probably skull, right? Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Can I speak to the boy? Hearth. Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy is at, sir. Path to truth. Yeah, I already I got one. Well, I mean, but I had to use it on a side size story. I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's oh, chosen safe. What have you chosen, sir? I don't know about this sense. Let me speak to the boy. Are you always this negative? Oh, I'm always next. I'm sir. always next to Seahorse. She's my girl. Only when dealing with idiots. Now let me to the boy. Yeah, I figure that. Goddamn lunatic! Who do you think you are? Come, oh, Arthur. Kid, come. On. This is better than this. Better than one in paradise? Better than these fools know a damn thing about paradise. Uh, um, you're if a real you look at my stream man. right now, you can see what sure. I am. Come on. There's not a chance. Jacket on there if I needed it. Okay. Are you out? Do you have the Punisher outfit then? Do you have the Punisher jacket? That's what it's called. Oh, okay. Alright. Oh. No! Too, but um, it, sometimes you can't walk in. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help. I know. I literally. Just stop and let's talk about us. Well, like literally, what happened was I was setting up my stream today, and three. Uh, two guys in a wagon were left. And I wasn't even in the you what you want And to all of a sudden, like, oh, you know about it? yeah, shot me. Like, really? Come on, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I would do it just to tell. What'd you do with Jamie, that one? I was like, you're from Blackwater. What'd you do? I killed them. Literally, a lot of them fall Come off the cliff. On, you this is crazy. I like. Crazy I was like, one. okay. No, I, I understand. You little jackass. Sorry, Mister. What do, Jamie? Live the rest of your life in the mountains with people. Oh yeah. I'm what are you talking between. about. You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm 
I'm a man now. I, I found something. A calling. Hold on, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna keep kick. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. Alone. They're good people. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. Leave me alone. Please, kid. Put that gun. I warn you, Arthur. I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, calm down. Leave me alone. Got it. Now calm down. Uh, Let's no. Go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Marry sweet on one another again? Uh, that's all a long time ago, son. Yeah. You can talk to him. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I s didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you yeah, taught me how. It's like the the too well apparently. Shalonia though, really? You'd fall for that? They were the, nice well, to me. It's kind of like a sin. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't any money. Of course I did. They were like. It depends, like Peter Jamie. Come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. I kept telling him was you won't to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't. Hey, don't talk about him. You want me to say he's a good father? Nice. He won't be happy. I saw you. Leave him my worst regards. The thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on. That ain't true. You lie. Um, well, um, don't think too hard. Yes. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. Yeah, and a chest. Carpentry or horses or something. That one? Yeah, I have that. I have work in an orchard. By that token, you must like online. shooting and robbing people. Oh, you don't. Only like shooting young idiots. Oh, I know. And then the thing is, if you don't have ammo, Father you can see, like, you bits and pieces. Ammo on it. Like if you run yeah, out, you it's not that cool. And, what was his name? H Hester. Jose. Yep. Still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Ben. I'm afraid. Yeah, and then you dead. get new ones. You buy. You. Uh, Maybe did make the right choice. Doubt. None of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. Is you two getting back together? Yeah. I, I did see it one. Do you need something? Yeah. What? Oh, I know. I use my pistol. Hold on, cutscene. Jamie! Jamie! Oh, please. You've... Father's been... Sad. My father wouldn't have died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank, thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. You, Arthur. And you. I've... you're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that.
Damn, we just got dissed by this ever. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confused me and me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make out off of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Sheriff. Well, look at here. Maybe this is our man. Bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. And you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long ago. You don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. That's him. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Cut. and pulling a trigger. Get some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. Phil at the saloon says, saw him by the gourd straight and over here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get caught before he dies. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. And we need right. him alive. That's an important point. Apparently, I, uh... I got it. I thought I, uh, I thought I already... Better? Um, I thought I, uh, what's it called? I thought I already did the bounty thing. Like, speak to the sheriff. But apparently I just walked in. And they're like, and then it was the cutscene, you know, how to get the sheriff stuff. Or the bounties. So... Yeah, that one. I I forgot. Did he, have you played the other one? The one from 360. Yep. Did did they talk about Arthur in the, that game too, or is this a brand new character? Well, actually, this is the funny thing. Uh, you know, Black Ops 4? Black, that just came out is a prequel to Black Ops 3. So Black Ops 3 happened before Black Ops 2. Yeah, you're all right, girl. So I guess this year, you know, I guess, I guess this year, Yeah, so... Yeah, I figured it. Shit, get in the water. No, no, no. There's a cliff. Come on, horse. No, I, I knew that, but, it, uh, you know, I, I asked in the Peru. Hey there, partner. Huh. Who are you? Oh, there's a bridge up there. Yeah. Go, seahorse. Go. Really? 
Wow, I didn't know that. No. Uh, what we got here? Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kinda look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay. Go. If you help me find him. It's just my money. Oh, uh, well, if that's the case, for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. <laughs> I'm a healer, you know, a medical man. Fire medicine in state. <laughs> <laughs> Game's over, mister. Put your to take it, me. What for? That stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. Well, ain't my That's crap. I, I, I speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This, this is a mistake. Keep Still your right. hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry. He's still alive. Still alive. I didn't hear him, but I was talking. One to leave. There you go. You're coming with me. Let's go for a ride. Come on, Seahorse. You can do it. Oh. 
Oh, I seem to keep blacking out. Huh. You do seem to keep blacking out. Oh. Sir, this isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. Oh, I feel very well. Told you, shut up. Why, who made you? Only money. Oh, I don't well at all. You're a bully, sir. There's a room. Yeah. Can you more it? Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting soon. Uh, Mrs. Calder. Sure. Where you want them? I'm selling the back. Oh, oh, there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. Oh, no. oh, but I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. If you ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner. I've already forgotten. Now, sure, um, how much was you off? Fifty dollars. Here. Madam. Now, please, remember what I told you. There we go. I did it. Let's see what's next. Uh, are these all marsh? <laughs> Damn, these are all. All right. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. 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 Believe I did that. No, 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 no. Seahorse. Go, Seahorse. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually ran into that person. And now I'm wanted. For what? Sorry, 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 sorry. I really hope there, that was like, you know, I didn't mean that. Oh, you know what? $20 for that. Let's, uh, let's head it. Yeah. Here we go. Let's feed it. Hey, have this, girl. Brush it. Mm -hmm. There, there, girl. There. Okay, girl. Good one, girl. I still can't believe I got a bounty for that. Into the horse, running into the horse. Jeez. You doing good, girl? Yes, yeah, so let's get. And then uh, go back to the other side missions, right? Other mission. How 
close am I? I'm not even close at all, gee. the way to camp yeah it was the way to camp Keep it going. Ooh, gotcha now if you want to keep your head you'll get down from okay good now Hands up. That's for teaching me. That robbed me. Stupid ass. Let's pick up my hat. And then just to be safe, I yep. was back on me. I'm sorry, boys. Uh, oh, I can't. Uh. You know what? You cook it. <laughs> I could cook it. Okay. Oh, sweet. All right. And boom. All right. Let's sleep. Why is this it? Until... No, we're all good. And then, tear down camp. <laughs> Come on, girl, let's go. Let's go. The apple seed timber company. Head farming. <laughs> We're still getting started on this site, but we should have some fine big valley lumber for sale very soon if you're interested. Keep that in mind. We're further along by now, but what can you do? I mean, <laughs> look at these dolts. There's not a brain between them. Listen, got any supplies for sale? Food, medicine, 
We're starting to run low, and I can't spare anyone to go into town. Things are going. I'd be happy to pay premium for them. Let's sell some goods. Yeah, he wants some uh, food. Appreciate it. That should help keep us going. There we go. Yep. All right, girl. Let's go. There's a girl. Yeah, you're all right, girl. Yeah. That's a good girl. Where is this thing at? I'm getting close. myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Can't think of a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, sir. Yep. Shall I hop up there? So I think that's... Yeah, I'm actually very... So that's They're actually... On the back with oh. you? Your legs work, don't they? Well, yes, I suppose. It's just a little... Demeaning. <sighs> Get on. What are you doing out here anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I don't uh, know. I'm just visiting. Uh, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't? Oh, yes. There was a country club about a burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. So I thought it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. <laughs> I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, Dan? It's a town of splinters. Call it much of a town at all. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. I suppose some might call it charming. <laughs> Let me tell you, tell with much these days. You show timber frame jack and I'll show you Broadway. And meanwhile, you have this mayor, a quite intolerable blow, a little bespoke woodwork, and he thinks this is a cultural hub? Man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. He must be quite the salesman. He did get all more fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. Uh, no offense. Let's take him. Oh, yeah. This does look familiar. Half of me wants them on the horse so they'll be faster. <laughs> He's from New York. So that means he has some good on him, but I can't rob him. <laughs> There's no option for that. That world of stairs. Oh, are we close to town? Are we close to town? I don't know. <laughs> Sir, you rescued me from the depth. You seem quite the resort, sir. If for some you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is really off with him. Alright, I will. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Alright, I don't need to follow this. Follow me around. So collect uh, that bounty. New Yorkers. Jesus.
still have a bounty on me. Hold on. Howdy to you. I'll just take care of that record for you directly. Yep. Yeah. There we go. Get rid of this That's bounty that I didn't mean to. Thanks, Mister. Come on, girl. All right, just in case. Yep. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the uh, dangerous gang, Como Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got One of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb. So maybe them's your boys. You can look right at when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. Arthur! Arthur! Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you gonna get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silent. You gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one here, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. You got any dynamite? Want to step back a bit? Yeah. Maybe that steam donkey over there. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Come on. What the hell are you doing? He wasn't O'Driscoll. I knew you were scum the moment I laid eyes on you. Okay, it's northern. Oh. Oh, 
You always was down that sack of crap. Excuse me a minute, Arthur. What was that? They had something of mine. I showed him, and I'll show you. You have really lost it this time. Good shooting, Morgan. Whew. I gotta hand it to you. What the hell was that you pulled back there? Got a bit wild. Wild? Making a house call in the... Ain't much I care about guns. That much is clear. Who was that? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't it? I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I no wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time... Yes, you will all be thanked profuse. I promise. Ah, uh, well, you're lucky got you back. For some unknown reason. I think we lost. I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. My way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was in a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot <laughs> out. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. <clears throat> Why you act all sour all yeah, the time. Yeah, well, you ain't funny here like the court chest. All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family, Arthur. You and me. Sons of Dutch makes us brothers. <clears throat> Sometimes brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back a straw. Come see me. Maybe I can make things you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Peace. Peace. Yeah.
swear I hope it's not like a thousand, not a thousand dollars, a thousand dollars. Get off my stupid bounty because I'm Dutch. That's sweet, I have two pistols. Oh, that's locked, that's why. What is this? Welcome, welcome. Hey up, bounty. Good on you. Get a fresh start. God damn it, Bush, you owe me eighty five bucks. Thanks for your assistance. Let's go, girl. All right, let's see what else. Oh, right. Let's go. Parody. Yeah. All right. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my... Well, that's what I want to be my thing. Take another picture of a grumpy house frau or pompous middle-class bird. Feed myself to the lions. Stand here. Here? Just... There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying... Of our great predators, before our greatest predators, kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Not the easiest, but well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens! My bag, that thing is right. Oh, good heavens! Don't worry. that thing. I'll... Sneaky one, too. Wild photographer. Coming back. Go. 
Thank you, sir. Bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I'm, I can't thank you enough. I'm, thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, you take care, sir. I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. <laughs> Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Okay, girl. How many? A lot. Bones everywhere. You see? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? <gasps> Who knows? Just keep your eyes open. I am. Yeah. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish pest? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the Blackwater to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and... <sighs> Pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh, well, we got a lot of in there. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's well, the one to try them pup. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or we cut him loose. I'm not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp near before. <sighs> we need to stop them before they camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government. Or government-like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean, and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Let's head up. Find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols at all over this area. Yes, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. Definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Highbot. 
Down there. Those my boys. All right, gentlemen. Blow me. Keep your guns always strong, okay? What you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Come on, let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? All right. He hasn't stopped talking as we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Push up, come on. Apparently, there's a way around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before can west. I imagine that's where they're headed. Sure. All right. Let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys. I hear they're a big crew. Wow. Built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yeah, that's definitely sh They're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. The other two down there. I've forgotten I follow him. We can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Stay here. In the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Gentlemen, excuse me, dear brother, I is ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's death. Where is she? Okay, come on. Stay low. I, I'm beside myself. I lose. If I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. <laughs> 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 Come on, let's get up there. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. 
We got two halfway up. Charles, you go right, okay? I guess. From here, Arthur. <laughs> you know, you're a lot less open than that other angle, Arthur. Come on. 
Do we get a hug out? A warm embrace for a lost town? You know, it means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that. I'm out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of sh snapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Here, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles bit separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine y'all missed me a lot, but fear not, they're joining your lives now. Got a tomahawk. Go, girl. Yep. Mr. Here, girl. Okay. Yep. Hey there. this. Hey, hey! Isn't that shit it is? Ah! Dr. Morgan himself! Open up a... 
Mister, I don't hardly know what. Thanks, I guess. You've done me a service. Hey, look, the stage company at this off is a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. But ain't stealing it already stolen. Got that right. Hope I didn't lose my uh Are you seriously? Oh, I was like Alright, let's keep going.
Yeah. Here we go. 